Well, a very good evening from Phuket. I don't know whether you can see the traffic here. It's absolutely crazy tonight. We're over in Chantelé. I'm going to be taking a look at the market that takes place here every week on a Friday. It's been quite a while since I did this area, Boat Avenue. There's a new shopping area just behind me we're going to take a look at shortly. We're going to take a look at the market first because the market's pretty good here at the Boat Avenue. It's actually um, behind Boat Avenue or um, in front of Boat Avenue depending on which way you're facing. But we're going to have a look at that and then the area area adjacent to the market but the traffic coming over tonight just unbelievable all the way down the road a long 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 way I'm glad I'm on the bike tonight and not in the car it would have took a very very long time in the car but let's make our way down to Boat Avenue so we're just right on the edge of it and of course Boat Avenue is the area where all the shops restaurants are positioned in Chantelay we're only five ten minutes away from the Laguna area this is a boat avenue you can see the sign just up there lots of choice here whether you're looking for fast food or proper restaurants they've got some really nice places here but as I've mentioned it's been a while since I've been over here so I thought it's about time to come over the problem that I have on a Friday normally I have to pick up ploy because she has extra schooling on a Friday but this week because it's Christmas I'm guessing she hasn't got any so I'm taking advantage of the opportunity nice Italian place over there and we've come over because I haven't got to pick her up tonight and the weather is absolutely beautiful at the moment well and truly high season has started and we're going to find our way down into the market area which is I forget now <laughs> we've got to go to the end by um, Villa Market and then we have the market area and this is a great market for food souvenirs well you're gonna see Anne's Kitchen just behind us there quite a well-known place just here behind some really good places over here for dining in Chantelay a place that I want to come and cover a little bit more but as I say the market only takes place here on a Friday evening so Friday is normally a bit difficult for me as I mentioned but you can see it's very busy Yeah, that's the Mexican place. So, I want to come and try this Mexican over here. Yeah, I've got to watch the cars. So, the market normally is just down here. Let's just see whether we can get a look at these exchange rates. So, we've got the US dollar 34, where's the euros 36 pound oh dear 40 not looking great okay well I'll let you have a look at those you can pause the video and take a look but they certainly wasn't looking great on the pound 40 baht to the pound it's dropped down a little bit was doing a little bit better than that before there's Villa Market very handy for um, shall we say European food they, they they have a fairly good range but they're not one of the cheapest supermarkets here on the island they can be quite expensive Villa Market but of course if you're staying in Chantelay it's nice to have the option donut shop that's opened up there I've not seen that before and then the market looks like it's going to be very busy tonight now the one thing I like about this market is it's lined with restaurants and bars so you can come to the market but if you're not eating here it's fine because there's plenty of choice right next to the market plenty of places to dine plenty of places to pick up a drink so we're gonna have a wander around here see what's on offer I'm sure and that's gonna be nosing because it's been a while since she's been over as I say quite a good market for souvenirs
not that size. You're up, sweetheart. Yeah, 50 bar. So the cab. Let's go down this side, sweetheart, and then we'll walk up the other way so we can get as much in. Okay. Yeah, it's going to be busy. Got quite a large food section here, so it's a great place to come and grab some food. I know I've mentioned about the restaurants, but of course you can eat if you want at the market. What are we gonna have, Nat? Okay, uh, Nat's seen something she wants to ask the price on. No, how much? Six hundred ninety. For the dress, good or not? No, oh, okay. That says you can find it cheaper online. Probably, probably can as well. Online's becoming big, big business out here. What's this chicken? Chicken curry. Mm. Korean chicken or Korean style chicken. Yeah, we're going to have to get something to eat because I'm hungry. Lots of barbecue here. Well, we'll have a look first and then we can... I haven't seen anything that's jumping out at me at the minute. Ooh, some big fish there. Yeah. Some fried chicken. Looks nice, the fried chicken, actually. Kebab, I might have a kebab. You can have one like that. Yeah, I know. I don't know. Sorry. I don't know what to have yet. Some hats. Hang on, that's where are you going? Ah. Sorry, cab. Can't go anywhere without meeting somebody we know. <laughs> Friend, you are? Huh? Ah? Famous. You're famous, eh? Also, eh? Huh? <laughs> Yeah. 
Then we unusual. Orange. You want sweet talk? Have Mexican food. Oh, have Mexican food, eh? I oh, see, yeah. Oh, hot dogs. Mexican hot dogs. Only for the last. Different. Not seen that before. Thank you so much for like supporting us. Let's have a look around first. There's a bit of a queue, so we'll have a look around. I might come back. Bring me. <laughs> Sausage rolls, scotch eggs, scotch eggs, oh those pasties. Sorry, Gab. Ooh, they look nice. They look nice. Oh, I might have a waffle. They smell good, the waffles. I'm going to try one of these. Cup and cap? <laughs> How much was that? Yeah, 95. Oh my god. Okay. That's mango. 
Hopefully it'll be good then. <laughs> mm. Yeah, on that. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, on that. One bit you can have. Uh, I'll take um, one of these. I like these. Um, yeah. Mango one not have. I'll have the cookie one then. Yeah, please. And this lady does the desserts. We know her from Villa Market over in Shillong. She's also over here as well. Some very, very nice desserts. You having a banoffee pie, Nat, or not? Banoffee? Mm, banoffee pie is lovely. You having one? Very busy tonight. Very busy indeed. Not ideal for filming tonight because there's so many people. Obviously, you've got to be careful you don't smack somebody in the face with a camera. Well, I hope you enjoyed that look around the market. As you saw, extremely busy. A bit difficult filming it actually with the camera. We're now making our way up to the new shopping area here in Boat Avenue. It's just outside next to Boat Avenue actually. I think it's called Porta del Phuket, something along those lines. We're going to have a quick look around there. As I say, this area is a great place if you staying in the Laguna Bantau come and visit a Chuntale because there's lots of shops as you can see lots of restaurants Friday night it gets a little bit hectic with the market but it's a great place to come and visit get some food on there we're not actually eating on the market tonight well I say we're not eating I had that croissant we're gonna actually go to Kindi which is one of our favorite restaurants in this area because I fancy a pizza as usual and their pizzas are hard to beat so we're gonna go and do that I'm not gonna film it because I have already covered Kindi first of all we're gonna take a look around this new shopping area 
Okay, so we're going to have a wander around here. I haven't had a look at this area before. I've said it's new. It's fairly new. I think it opened last year, if I remember rightly. I'm not quite sure how long it's been actually open for now. But it's fairly new. It's got all your designer names and shops here. A few restaurants inside, places to eat, etc. Actually quite big isn't it? It's bigger than I thought it was. It stretches back quite a long way. I don't think everywhere has been taken yet. But there's a reasonable amount of shops that I can see. So if you're looking for something special, maybe have a wander around here. Designer shops, clothing etc. There's a food hall, Tops food hall that I can see. Not quite sure what they mean by a food hall, whether it's a supermarket or a place to eat. I think it's uh, a place to eat. They've got a wine connection here. Yeah, a lot of people at the moment around Christmas. A lot of people here. Very busy. Oh, they have actually got a supermarket as well as the food place, I've just noticed. So they've got the top supermarket as well as the tops food court so that's handy if you want to come down and get some groceries maybe you're staying in a villa and you want to get the fridge stocked up a lot of villas around this area in the Laguna area etc uh, yeah a lot of people outside dining tonight I can see a lot of people wow very very busy should mention the date today's date is the 29th of December so we're coming up to New Year number is it number 30? Yeah, tomorrow 30 uh, okay what? um we're just trying to decide on what the date is it is actually you're right I'm wrong it is 30 today apologies 
steakhouse there. Argentinian steakhouse. Well, I hope you've enjoyed tonight's video, this look at the Chantelet area, the Friday night market and of course Porta del Phuket, this fairly new shopping area here in Chantelet. If you're staying locally, Bantau, Laguna, then this area is very worthwhile coming in and checking out some of the restaurants. Some great choice here, great market on a Friday night. Just remember it is only on a Friday night. Do check out the description for all the links. I will post any relevant details down there. Don't forget to check out my Facebook group if you haven't already. Do like and share the video and of course consider subscribing if you like my content. And I guess that just leaves me to say as always thanks for watching and until next time you take care and I'll catch you on the next one.